Oh, you think darkness is your ally, but you merely adopted the dark. I was born in it, molded by it. I didn't see the light until I was already a man, and by then it to me it was nothing but blind. Okay, so clearly you're one dude who doesn't mind being blind, but the rest of the world, they wouldn't mind a cure. My name is Mike McCredden, talking about curing the blind via algae, here for you on IO. Of all your senses, which one could you live without? For me, I'd probably go without hearing. That or taste. But I want to hear from you guys in the comments down below. Now, science may in fact have found a way to give sight to the blind, and it involves algae. That green goo at the bottom of the sea, it uses a protein known as Channel Rodespin 2 to find sunlight and begin photosynthesis. Because the protein is light sensitive, its activity is akin to that of the human eye. In the eye, proteins known as photoreceptors, well, they're shaped as rods and cones and they transmit light. And when these proteins die off, well, that's when vision can weaken and eventually disappear altogether. Now the process is a little more complex than scooping out some algae from the sea and just putting it in your eyeball, but it's not that much more complex. In 2006, Dr. Zuo Hu Pen, a Wayne State University researcher, extracted the protein from algae. He then introduced it to mice who suffered from photoreceptor degeneration. All of a sudden, it worked on his first attempt. Mice. Can you imagine there were three of them? <laughs> you know what I mean? Now they are finally ready to start rolling out some tests on humans. So this could mean really big things. Be like that Val Kilmer movie at first sight all over the place. Dudes be looking at cotton candy, people think talking about clouds. You know what I mean? Does anyone know what I mean? Has anyone seen that movie? Probably not. Now before anyone goes berserk like my buddy Bane, who wants the world to live in blindness, this protein that they've extracted from the algae, it is 2,000 times less sensitive to light than the proteins that we got in our eyes. So you might be seeing better, but certainly not seeing perfect. But granted, anyone living in the dark, they'd be happy to get some kind of visual. All right, guys, that's all I got for you this time. Let me know what sense could you live without if you had to pick in the comments down below. Also, other videos here on Informal Low, be sure to check out one of those. My name is Michael McCredden, and I'll see you guys in another video. Also, let me know what you thought about my Bane impression. That was my voice. I'm working on it. I'm working on it. Okay, I'm working on it. Oh, oh, I can't remember what he says.